apart. These old silos have been standing for more than 60 years. But the concrete silos have been empty for decades, and they're crumbling. So the decision was made on the O'Brien farm to keep the barn but lose the silos. Nearby power and phone lines had to come down for the day. Then holes are made in the silo so a large cable can be attached to a tractor. To make sure the silos fall on open ground and not into the barn, the concrete is knocked out on one side with sledgehammers, very carefully. Then a little tug from the tractor and kaboom. terrifying. I was so afraid that something would go wrong and somebody would get hurt. And, uh, these guys did just a phenomenal job. Uh, we recycle it all too. So we take we separate the debris out and uh, the concrete goes to one place, gets ground up, reused as road base, the metal gets recycled. And not a lot of people own silos anymore and it's really kind of sad to see them go. When I was a girl, um, I found a lot of kittens in that silo. <laughs> The demolition, demolition crew said those old-style concrete silos are disappearing fast. Most of the new silos are made from steel. Well, the next Minnesota farm has some decades-old silos. Look at that. Came down. We'll show you more coming, along, coming up. And you know, it's not going to be long until that thought. I guess it did record it twice, huh?